Hey, what's up guys? Azu Gaming here, and today I have a special little commentary for you guys. Um, I'll call it my 50 sub special because it's I almost have 50 subs. I'll be there pretty soon, so, you know, I'll just call this that. This is my um, 100 plus gameplay on Black Ops 2. I ended up going 106-1, and, and it was a pretty nice gameplay. I mean, I guess I camped a little bit, well, a lot of bit. And kill streaks is basically what got me there, because in Black Ops 2 that was the most prevalent thing there. I mean, if you got kill streaks, you basically got a lot of kills because they were so overpowered. And um, I'll just let you guys know uh, this gameplay is not HD. It's when uh, Black Ops 2 first came out, and this is back when I had a uh, dazzle, so it's not going to be HD. But I did speed up. Uh, the parts where I wasn't like getting kills or and I sped up the kill streaks cuz nobody wants to watch um, me just launching bombs on people from a load star or a VTOL warship so speeded that up pretty quick and I would tell you guys what I'm using but honestly I forget so I can kinda guess what I'm using um, I'm pretty sure I'm using the uh, LSAT well I know it's the LSAT uh, suppressed and with extended mags, I believe. And I'm running uh, Bouncing Betty and Tactical Insertion with the Warthog, Lodestar, and VTOL Warship killstreaks. And um, on this part right now, I'm just kind of like uh, sitting over in, uh, back in our spawn, uh, going into the line of sights where I can see it back into theirs. I'm just kind of picking people off with the um, uh, nice range of the... Um, LMGs have in this game, and I will come out and say that I'm only doing this commentary one time, you know, I don't want to, it's a nine minute gameplay, I really don't want to commentate this like ten times, so if I mess up, I apologize, I'm not uh, going to do something over, uh, because, you know, I just don't have that kind of time, I got <laughs> better things to do, sorry if that offends you guys, but it's true. Actually, not really, but, you know. So, my only death, my one death, is actually from me. When I get my Warthog here pretty soon, it actually ends up killing me, which kinda sucks, but it's whatever. I mean, I guess I'm just that good that I can only kill myself. And, um... Some topics I want to talk about. This is a long commentary, so uh, I got like seven, eight, nine, uh, five minutes left. So six minutes left. So uh, I'm going to talk about my life. You guys don't know me very well, so I shall explain. Um, I go to high school. Uh, I'm a sophomore right now. Um, I play basketball, football. Football as in um, American football, not soccer. And um, I was going to do track this year, but I um, got a stress fracture. I'll talk about that later. Um, I'll expand on that. And um, I have a dog, a uh, Shih Tzu. <laughs> yeah, I know, <laughs> Shih Tzu. But uh, its name is Swagger. Uh, uh, I... Mm, go to school, I never study, um, too busy playing video games, but I end up getting A's and B's, so that's alright. Um, video games is life, yo, uh, it's like my favorite thing to do, sorry if I keep saying uh a lot, uh, it's what I do when I can't think, so sorry in advance. I want to be a software designer when I'm older so that I can hopefully work at Activision someday and, you know make a difference in Call of Duty because right now you know it's not exactly headed in the right direction in my opinion and I'll expand on this now I guess because there you know now you know me um you know they've taken a lot of things out that the original Call of Duties have I don't know if you guys have played uh, Call of Duty 4 or anything or not yeah Call of Duty 4 Modern Warfare 1 Ooh, sick double right there but that game was one of the best and then Modern Warfare 2, I mean, after that, I 
didn't know how it could get better, and honestly, it didn't. It's been downhill ever since Modern Warfare 2. Modern Warfare 3 was pretty good, though. I, I, I like that game. But I'm not a big fan of all the Black Ops, you know? I don't really like Activision. I'm more of an Infinity War fan. And after they got rid of all the um, developers of Infinity War, like all the original ones, it's been going downhill, I'm not going to lie. Ghosts, I like a lot, but I kind of really wish they wouldn't have gotten rid of the UAV and the um, stuff that made the game, like, that made it Call of Duty, like, the original stuff, you know? Like, I think they just tried to do too much, and they changed too much, like, too quick, you know? And I'm, I don't really like that. But don't get me wrong, Ghost is still a great game, and I do like it a lot more than Black Ops 2 and uh, Black Ops 1. But if I was going to rank it in the um, Infinity Award side of the game, I'd say it's probably, oh, uh, third. Like, first, or, yeah, probably third. Mono for 2, Mono for 1, Ghost, and then Mono for 3. But that's just my humble opinion. Don't have to um, listen to me or anything because you are not entitled to. So, alright. Moving on. I, um, my stress fracture. Start with that. The past six weeks I've been on crutches because of my stress fracture. Now, some of you might think I'm a pussy, but, you know, it is what it is. I, it's not healing, and if you've ever had one, you'll know it's not really that much of a pussy injury, because it does hurt very bad and it, they are hard to get rid of. I mean, in some spots they can go away, like if you get them in like quote unquote good spots, they can go away in like two to three weeks, four weeks, around there. But mine's like deep in my tibia, deep in like the bone, whatever, in like the dense part. So it's not healing. So I've been on crutches for six weeks and I honestly don't know if I'm ever going to get off of them. Like, they said I'd probably be ready to play basketball in, like, summer. So, I got a while till I'm 100%. So that's why I'm getting, going pretty hard on video games right now. And it's kind of sad, but a lot of people give me a lot of crap because all I do is play video games. But it's like, well, what am I supposed to do? I mean, I can't go out and shoot hoops, I can't go out and run, I can't even, heck, I can't even play hide and seek or anything, even though it's a little kid's game, I can't, well, not a little kid's game, but, like, I, I can't do anything, like, really, like, I can't even hide because I can't get to a place to hide, I can't do anything because I can't walk, you know, it's, it's rough, and I'm just glad that I got cleared for swimming, uh, I can finally do swimming therapy, so I've been swimming, like, every day, and it's actually made me... Uh, more fit and like it helps me keep in shape and it's actually made me happier <laughs> I'm not gonna lie I was getting pretty depressed just sitting up in my room all day and it's you know it gets kinda boring every day just going up to my room play video games uh, you know after about <laughs> two and a half months it gets kinda boring but um, on to other topics uh, I'll just talk more about the gameplay I mean right now I mean Calling in more kill streaks, just wrecking people with my VTOL. Uh, yeah, those dope quad feeds though. Um, my strategy when we split sides was just to camp in that uh, top room and you know just sit up there and put a Betty behind me and just hope nobody comes up from behind. Which I'm gonna say. To get these kind of gameplays, you know, 100 plus, I mean, you gotta be playing against some hardcore noobs, like, these guys didn't leave, these guys didn't do anything. But that about wraps up the gameplay. I hope you guys enjoyed. Sorry it's not HD. Um, it was when I just first started doing YouTube. So, I'm Azu Gaming, and I'm out.